Hey guys, Shung here. In this video, we're going to show you how to make the quick GoPro intro inside of Premiere Pro. If you are here for the intro video for downloads, there'll be a link in the description below and follow the instructions on the website to download it. And uh, yeah, if you want to learn how to make it inside of Premiere Pro and also do it for different brands on different kind of cameras, uh, stay tuned and I'll show you how to make it. So let's start. So I'm going to grab a image that I've already prepared of the GoPro Hero 9 Black and I've already removed the background uh, with Photoshop just uh, quickly and I've also gotten the logo. So I've already have marked down some of the timing so actually so the video will be around 4 seconds so at 4 second mark let's actually cut it already here. So we have the video ending at four seconds. And actually at uh, five frames in, uh, it stays black. And then after five frames, the GoPro uh, image appear. So hold on, shift arrow to the right five and jump to five frames. And here we can so move these two like that. So we have total black first and then the logo or the GoPro jumps in. And uh, actually, let's uh, change the scale of this GoPro because it's quite big. Change it to 75 here. And the logo actually needs to be bigger also. 150 there. So we have this set. So now we're going to go to effects. We're going to grab the transform effect and put it onto both of these clips. And also I need to have the crop on the GoPro logo. And now we go to effects control. And at 1 minute and 10 frames, we have the GoPro uh, starting to move. So here we're going to go to transform. And we're going to use position here. Click this stopwatch for a keyframe. And hold down shift arrow to the right. Jump to five frames. And now we're going to move this GoPro to a position we think uh, we need to have it. This is not like a real proper, like precise number i think yeah minus 80 should be fine so now we have these keyframes if we play it we can see that the gopro moves quickly out of the way however there's no motion blur so we go to here inside of transform change the use composition shutter angle to turn this off and under it the shutter angle we type in 180 for a more natural sh motion blur when we play this we see like the gopro camera moving with a nice motion blur. So now we're on the GoPro logo. We are going to change the position with motion first. So here we position it in a way where we find it looks good. And yeah, I think this just eyeballing it looks fine here. And we're going to go to the transform here. Click on the stopwatch for a keyframe. And we go and click shift and arrow to the left to jump back five frames. And from here we move the GoPro logo back. So actually going to toggle this eye of the camera layer to turn it off. Right mouse click here, I'm going to turn on safe margin so I can know where the middle is. I want the GoPro to be like more further back. So going to move the cam here to here. So we have it here in the middle. So now I have the GoPro logo placed like over the half here. And now to the here to this five here and back to the logo here and we're going to use the crop going to click crop here 
want to just crop the here from the start of the GoPro. So from left side, so we're just barely touching it like that. So let's turn back everything on and if we play this like that. see if we did that correctly so we also need to animate the crop if I see it correctly here so from this point especially so here we click on the left here stopwatch then next especially here we can see that the text here gets cropped and from here I think it's okay to have it full and here that'd be fine and go here to also composition shutter angle and also make this 180 to get that motion blur and now when we play this we have the yeah GoPro Hero intro made now if we turn off the safe margins we can see the entire thing. So that was the quick GoPro intro inside of Premiere Pro. Hope you found this a very useful tutorial and if you really like it press the like and subscribe button here below. And if you want to see more videos there are links popping up in the video right now that you can click on and check out my other videos. And see you in the next video. Bye bye.